Generic greetings and welcome back to PC Building Simulator. Today's beverage is a nice cup of tea and today's music is from the Curse of Monkey Island because if you had the choice why would you not? So in the previous episode we did the typical computer shop stuff which includes but it is not limited to dusting our PCs, replacing parts and overall fixing things in this episode more of the same. So we need to do one thing let's go over to our emails we can see that uh, this job here um, this is from Jamie uh, Martelli they want to upgrade their graphics cards. So if we go to PC stats we can see that they have an R9 290GR8 and to be fair it is on the bench here and we can see that in there as well so we need to get something that's going to be better than that within budget so if we go over to part ranking we can see that uh, hair one just to remind was r9 290 gr8 so that is r9 290 gr8 there so there it is there which is ranking six so that's quite a decent card here um, and you can see there's ones above it so we could just go for the very next one which is the uh, radion r9 290 uh, great or <laughs> <laughs> Good grief, uh, which is only slightly improved. I mean, that's like probably less than 10% there, so maybe a uh, bit of a false economy, but let's just see what we can get. So we'll go to shop and we'll see. Uh, so, mm, GR, do you want to go for that? GR? No, um, I don't know if we'll do that or not. Let's just go for R9. We'll see what R9s we can get within budget. So, R9. You can see there's a fair few R9s, and the budget is 340. So we can see that we've got this one here, which is theirs. So theirs is um, 300 generic units of currency. The upgraded one, the greater, that's 325. And to be fair, that would make us a tiny bit of profit, but we're really just going for the labor. We want to give them the best that they can get. So the next highest up from that would be a Sheen GeForce GTX 980 Gamer. So let's go back to shop and we'll say 980 this time. And if we go down, we can see there's a Sheen uh, GeForce GTX 980 Gamer 340, which is exactly how much they've given us. So that is what we're going to do. So let's go to the cart. We will say next day delivery. Buy that now. That's going to be 600 generic units of currency. I've already went ahead and accepted another job, which is uh, diagnose and fix. There's another two here, which is uh, upgrade the CPU, but I'm not going to pick those up just yet. So let's just go over to this one and we will end the day. And obviously the next day now is now and we will be able to... Uh, Go to work and get some parts. There's a lot of parts there, so we'll check that out in a bit. So I need to upgrade this machine here, so let's do just that. So we'll click on that, and I really like the soundtrack. <laughs> I don't want to play it too much, though, because quite frankly, it's almost certainly going to uh, get claimed because good old YouTube. All right, so we'll strip the case off and uh, take this apart. So we'll remove the graphics card there. There we are. Then we will install graphics card of the, uh, where is it? It is that one there. So there we are. Put that on and then that's now plugged in. Install PC part side cover. That'll go on there. Two screws. And then we'll give a little bit of the old power there and we'll see if it boots. And that should be okay. Um, I don't think there was anything else in there that we really had to take note of. Uh, sheen parts are really good, yeah, so that's fine, so we've done that. So that now loads up, and we can see that this is now sorted, so we're going to pick that up, we're going to dump it down, and we are going to collect that, which gives us uh, a decent uh, rating, a, th a 4 out of 5 stars. Um, so I wonder what, why it went, I mean, sheen parts are really good, um, it's dusty. I thought I cleaned it out, so apparently I've just messed that up. Okay, oh well. So, uh, we're going to go to this one, which is upgraded to 16 gig RAM, so we'll pick this up and we'll do just that. So we'll plonk it down and we can see we've already got uh, the one stick there, but that's um, not good enough because I uh, messed that up, as always. Let's go over to the, uh, where is it, memory. Loads of incompatible stuff here, uh, but that is the one that we bought. So we will say that one and we'll install it. And that should be um, okay once we put the rest in, so install... So instead of just getting the other stuff, we, uh, well, I, the royal we, um, just got the uh, the four gig sticks. So that should be all there. There's a second hand one there, which is incompatible, wrong speed. That is now up to the required amount. So we'll put the side back on there. One screw, that now powers up. So that is good. And then we will place that in the corridor and um, 
hand that in as well. So collect that one, and there you go. So the, the RAM upgrade went well and cleaned it up. Nice, excellent, so that's fine. So we'll discard that one there. We've got another upgrade graphics card, which we will pick up, and we'll place it in here. And we will remove that card. We'll have to remove this uh, weird thing at the back. Uh, let's just spin it round. Get a bit better view on that one. And then it should just come off there. That's fine. And that card comes off. I will install graphics card. And I believe it was... Um, I think it was this one. So let's just put that in there. That's a lot bigger card though. See that? Uh, also, cabling will have to be... Uh, connected up as well. Uh, let me just double check to make sure this is the right card that I'm installing actually Because uh, it's been a couple of days since the last episode uh, Doesn't tell us who the owner was I don't think hang on it might do when we're out of that mode or the original owner was um, Those are the ones we've missed uh, removed then that's there so it's a 1050 Ti parts picker uh, Part ranking rather parts picker is <laughs> a useful site actually um Yeah, I think that's fine. Yeah, okay, right. And that should be the 2G. So it's the... 1050Ti Gaming versus the... Uh, 9962G. 1050Ti. That one there, and up there. Yeah, I think we're okay. Okay. Install. Side panel. Actually, no, not side panel not side panel um, we'll have to put the cover back on there we go and that should be that in fact what I'll do is I'll power it first install side panel one two three four powers up placing corridor right collect Four stars. Got a, my PC got a better graphics card, and they didn't try to fob me off with second-hand parts, which is nice. Excellent. This is good. Uh, this one, though, you can see how there's other bits here. Uh, we've got loads of new parts available. Um, we got 980Ti's, got uh, RX 470's. We've got, what's this one here? It's embarrassing, I need something repaired. I keep getting graphics errors. Urgent, please hurry, Nicola. That's replaced graphics card. We've got ones here. Um, upgrade, graphics card, and RAM. Um, oh, this is... <laughs> Uh, Blake Pattersburg, or Patterberg rather, 48 at movie uh, maniacs.co.uk. Sonic Monk needs your help. Uh, replace the hard drive, okay? And then this one here is um, upgraded to score a 3D mark. Um, so we'll check this one here, diagnose and fix. So this is the main one. It's the reason why I haven't picked up others because I don't know what it's going to be. My gaming rig isn't booting anymore. I don't know what's wrong with it. Can you diagnose what's wrong with it? It seems to power on okay. The fans go around but doesn't get any further past the BIOS screen. Ooh, okay. So that could be it could be a number of things. Uh, diagnose what's wrong. Turning the power on to see what happens off in the BIOS will give you a clue what's wrong. If not, nothing happens then it could be a broken PSU. If that doesn't help, work your way through the components till you find the broken ones. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll say cable. We'll connect all of this up. There we go. And power. So we got fans there, fans there. That's fine. Um, error, no CPU found. Right, the CPU's busted then. Okay. Yeah, I'm guessing so. Let's power it back off. And we want to delete to enter the BIOS. No, you have to hold delete. Hang on. Can you power it off from this? Oh, you can. So that, hold delete. Right, so there's the BIOS. A regular corporation BIOS. We can see the date, chipset, no CPU found, RAM seems to be okay, RAM speed, yep, uh, 1050 Ti in there, storage is good, uh, RAM overclock, we don't want to do that, settings, uh, we don't want to change the boot device, um, okay, so we will just basically, well, we shouldn't power it off, but we will do that, and we need to remove the CPU and replace it, so we will do just that. So cabling can come out, a uh, cooler can come out, we can see we've got a, a Ryzen, a Ryzen 5 quad core 1500X. So minimize, uh, CPU, is 
is it that one? Inventory one. Ryzen 5 quad core 1500X inventory is one, but it's broken in terms of the email. They're gonna, yeah, pay the exact amount, so that's the one. So we'll add that to the cart. So while we're on, um, we're gonna get something else around here. Super sluggish, can you get another CPU? I think I just click on some of bag benchmarking is really important, do you think? PC stats. Right, looking at this here, they've got an A320M MTech Plus motherboard with a Ryzen 5 quad core 1400. And they're giving us for this 190. Well, that's exactly what this thing costs. So I'd want a cart. So I think that'll be the upgrade that we need. I'm assuming, perhaps wrongly, <laughs> that a. Um, 140 is not as good as 150x, and that is correct according to that part picking program, which is good. There, yes, that's fine. That's definitely what we've got. Yep, yeah, that's okay. We'll accept that job then, because that should be a quick one. It's an upgrade required. Don't know what that'll be. Uh, this one. Place hard drive. Broken parts. What's broken? It says replace hard disk drive. Um, I'll check that later. But I need someone prepared. I keep getting graphical errors. Urgent, please hurry. I might have visited too many dodgy sites. Regards, Nicola. Replace graphics card. PC stats. I keep forgetting about this PC stats here. And they want a 1050 gaming 2G. Can we get that in one go? Graphics card. 1050 120 they're gonna pay 120 to be fair there's others as well but I'll get the I'll get it just says replace it does definitely say replace right mm. need something repaired to keep it yeah replace graphics card so it's definitely a GTX 1050 gaming 2g GTX 1050 Gaming 2G, uh, and I think it was MSI at the cart. I'll just double check the MSI. I'm pretty confident it was MSI, yeah. I just saw the, the red colour. Um, so, that's two processors and the um, the graphics card turning up tomorrow. I will accept that task, obviously. I will now uh, say come tomorrow, and that should be yours. Um, I think so. Yeah, okay, so we'll go to the next day, so end of day, and we will go to work. Obviously, big delivery there, and we got some stuff to sort there, but let's just quickly replace this, uh, the uh, the processor. We'll sell the broken one, because we really don't need that, so that's getting installed. Uh, you can see that's all connected up. We'll close the lever arch. We will install some thermal compound. We'll install some... Uh, processor cooling facilities and then we will connect that up to there and why are those case fans not powered up were they never powered up in the first place I don't think the front <laughs> why would the case fans not be connected up that's interesting um, I'm just gonna power that up and see what the deal is so get rid of that back to email Definitely that one. That's powering up now. Right. Can you guys what's wrong with it? I seem to be powering okay. The fans go around, but it doesn't get any further past the iron screen. Can you have a look to fix whatever's wrong with it? So, yeah. Um, apparently, the fans have either... either Whatever I've done there, it removed the front fans. I didn't notice, actually. I, I, no, I checked that these fans were going, but I didn't see the other ones. So, that's a, hopefully a good job job. We'll find out in a moment. Bang! Five star. Excellent. Alright, so we will go to PC. Upgrade CPU. So, take this off. And we need to get the cable removed as well. Just try to work our way in there. And that should be, yep, you can see that is the Ryzen 5 quad core. Uh, 1400 or 140 or whatever you want to call it. Um, so CPU, um, CPU and processors. So it's that one there. And then we'll install that. That should be a nice little upgrade for them. Install. 
put a little blob, little dab on there. Uh, cooling. And, I mean, you can, like, do, like, 180, but, no. Uh, now you can see it, it does actually snap into position, <laughs> which is sensible, I guess. Um, that connects up to there. Nothing else. That's fine. I will put the side on and give it a... Can you power it while you're in the middle of putting these screws in? You cannot. That's sort of sensible. Power. And that should be fine. But I think we have to bench it. So, just checking it's that PC. It is. So PC is sluggish, need you to upgrade the CPU. Done. Um, can you get it done within eight days? Yes. I think I clicked on something bad. Benchmarking your changes is really important, don't you think? Okay, so install. USB drive. Ah, if you press escape before it's fully connected, it uh, goes all over the place. Screenshot. Ah, my diary. No, no. Anyway, so we'll say um, virus scanner because they said they clicked on something bad and then we'll put the, put the... Uh, the bench on there as well. I'm still unsure. I'm still unsure as to if you have to remove the parts or not. Oh uh, well. Uh, sorry, remove the uh, programs rather. Uh, so there's that there, and I wanted just to do that way. I didn't restart after every install. I didn't think it was strictly necessary. Our star rating is three three and a bit stars now. So that's improved massively since. Um, we took over from Uncle Useless. Yeah, cool. So we want to do virus scanner first, because if there's anything funky, that could uh, slow the bench down. And now we'll do the bench. And not terribly good, but it's not as bad as some of the other ones, that's for sure. <laughs> right. So we've got another one in the corridor, which is to replace the graphics card, which we have. So that should be a simple task. I... Do I want to buy the bench here? Um, upgrade the workshop? I think I do. I think I do. And I've just got an achievement for it as well. I think long term that's pretty much what we have to do. I mean, it's not left us with much money at all, but once we complete these two jobs, we should get a nice bit. And we've got some more jobs to do as well. So, um, we, we will remove that. And this, and hopefully the graphics card that I've got is all fine. That's an interesting place to put the the uh, SSD. Normally they go on the... Well, I mean they can go anywhere to be fair, but I've seen them normally go on the back there. Ah, oh, maybe that's why. Because it's um, two panels on that. Uh, yeah, it's glass panels on both sides. Not that you see much from that side. Um, so, it is graphics cards... I want to sell that broken one, we sort of do. I mean, we could put some used parts in, but I'm just going to double check. Um, is that still benching? It really is. Um, so. Install. Um, I'm sure that one. Is that not the right one? That might have been the right one. Well, it boots. <laughs> I'm missing cable. Ah, oh, the power cable. There we go. That's been benched. You see, it's uh, pretty decent. He says without... <laughs> Knowing exactly what that if, if that number's good or not, uh, that should be okay now. So, and yeah, there we go. My CPU got better. Uh, my PC got better CPU, and it's using um, it's and using it is a massive pleasure now. Okay, good. So upgrade CPU complete by the end of eight days. We uh, also benched it as well as. Um, did some virus scanning so that's that fine and we got five stars so it really doesn't matter whether you keep the uh, whether you keep the loads of stuff here look at all these jobs wow loads and loads of new parts another 980 ti cryo oxy 7 an rx 470 some more ram uh, yeah it doesn't matter whether you keep the keep the stuff in there or not the uh, programs so uh, i think i've got went on too many dodgy sites so the graphics card has been replaced and we've got the rest of it sorted so we'll just put the case back on but obviously we need to uh, 
do a bit of a virus scan, which we will do in but a moment. Install tools and software, USB drive. That can go on there, and then we will. Oh, Dota 2. Oh, it doesn't work. Um, add remove programs, virus scanner. And our rating has been going up quite a bit, which I'm very pleased about. <sighs> okay. So almost done. Entry in the BIOS just to see what the deal is. Let's have a look. Ryzen 5 quad core, 1400, clocked at uh, 3.4 gigahertz. Only one, only eight gig of RAM though, and it's not not terribly fast either. Hmm, okay, settings. Uh, I change and restart. Didn't do any changes. I've not really messed around with a lot of the. BIOS stuff in this game, or BIOS stuff in general, I just tend to stay away from it if I have, <laughs> if I have to. Um, and that's our PC done, and we're going to shut it down properly, and we'll pick it up. Dump it in the corridor, accept, boom, another five stars. So, they fixed the graphics card in my machine, and they did a great job. That's brought our star rating now to over four and a half stars out of five. We are level four about another fifth of the way there to level 5 with 758 generic units of currency to spend on whatever we want. But I think we will leave it there. There's many, many other jobs we could do. Uh, we've got new parts as well. A lot of these ones are getting more, um, more challenging as in, instead of just dusting things out, it's a case of I need a 3D Mark score of this, and it's more trial and error, like you just have to sort of know. Um, and that, uh, you know, is quite an interesting thing. Also, eventually we'll get to water cooling stuff lab, but I think we'll leave it there for now. I think we've had uh, our fill, really, of uh, messing around with that. Uh, but uh, I'm going to keep the save, and if we want to jump back on this and try in the future, then that's something that we will do. Hope you have enjoyed the video and the series. Thank you very much for watching. Take care, and generic partings. <laughs>